Yo, what's up guys? My name's Hacky and Rockstar has finally dropped what we've all been waiting for for years now. We can finally customize police cars. We got three different options, the police riot van, the regular cruiser, and then the unmarked cruiser. Personally, I'm gonna go for this one just because I do actually like the lights on the top of the vehicle. And if you can, make sure you unlock the trade price for it because otherwise it's gonna be very, very expensive. It's still pretty expensive with the trade price, $3.5 million for this this one let's go ahead and buy it and i'm gonna put it in the eclipse boulevard garage so let's go and customize this thing customizing it is gonna be the most exciting thing definitely so i can't wait this might be one of the coolest vehicles we can customize oh even the lighting pattern is so freaking cool it's a little different from your average cruisers and it doesn't look like we can actually customize it in los santos customs i'm fine customizing it inside of the arena so it looks like we can only customize it in places like the office the agency the arena workshop shop or any other place you have a vehicle workshop inside of let's see what type of upgrades we can put on this thing headlights since we're in the arena we can actually put different colored headlights i'm just gonna do it regularly just because if i were to do colored ones that's not the most realistic and i'm trying to go for a more realistic look so let's go for xenon lights and then liveries so this is where we get creative here so it looks like the lspd one just changes the numbers crime scene unit is also a different set of numbers and then this one's a canine unit livery so it adds a little canine on the back doors and of course changes the number on the car prisoner transport so these are a bunch of different sets of numbers and now it actually changes so we have a modern lspd livery that one does look really nice i have to say we have state trooper this is another highway patrol one i like that little star the sheriff one does look pretty clean i have to say we have richmond pd you can barely see it just because we have white on there but it's richmond police with a little number 12 right there Los Santos International Airport. That's a pretty cool one. It's very simple, but I like it. Rockford Hills. Okay, this one's pretty clean too. Del Perro Police. We have so many liveries, by the way. Davis Police. And this one's kind of meh. Del Perro PD is actually a pretty clean one. And then we have Port Authority. Not bad. Polito Bay Police. This one's nice. I like this one on the side. Light Police. This is a pretty simple one. Another Highway Patrol one. Highway Patrol once again. Another Sheriff one. What's the difference between these? I don't exactly know, but we have a county park ranger. Okay, this is some different colors we got going on here. A canine unit version of it. We have a stealth police. This is a super classic livery. Nothing too crazy about this one. County sheriff stealth version. So I'm guessing for stealth versions, we just need to make the car like all black. My favorite liveries would probably be LSPD modern and then Del Perro police. Those two are my favorite. I think I'm gonna go for modern. They're just so freaking clean, but also the LSIA one is also nice. The canine unit is also very simple and clean. I do like the logo on the front door right there okay this is where we got serious so we got aerials looks like we can put some antennas on the roof oh we can put cameras that's actually so sick we can put them either on the roof or on the back of the vehicle or actually on both it looks like yeah we can put like two on top and then two on the back or maybe four up top i definitely want to have some tech on it so should i go two on the front and two on the back i don't really like the layout of the antennas with this one so i think i'm gonna go for this one this one is very symmetrical I like it. It's pretty cheap as well. We can change it anytime for a very small amount of money. And then we have different types of searchlights. I don't really like the look of this one, but this one with the two different searchlights on each side are actually kind of sick. You know what? The basic searchlights are really simple and clean. I'll take them. Emergency lighting. So we can either have this one, we can have no light at the top, or we can have this like slim horizontal one. I think this one by far looks the cleanest. So I'm definitely going to go for custom emergency lights lighting two. And then the push bar. What does this do? Okay, just the bar on the front of the vehicle. We can have lights on it. I don't really like that. You know what? The thin lights actually work kind of well with the lights we have on the roof. So let's actually go for this one. And then respray. We can actually change the freaking color of this car. Okay, what in the world? I do want to make this a bit more realistic. So let's actually go for something clean. The secondary color is actually going to change the color in the middle of the car. Either an all black or an all white would probably look best. Let's 
let's see what it looks like with all ice white that actually doesn't look too bad but i think an all black would look even better brushed black steel actually looks pretty solid let's see what it looks like with all black steel okay that does look pretty clean suspension i'm gonna leave it transmission turbo do we have a specific set of wheels for this one or we could just leave the stock wheels on it they don't look too bad actually this one looks pretty decent let's go with that should we tint the windows let's give it a light smoke i would say yeah so this is the police cruiser we got the siren pattern on the top is actually so freaking sick i have to say this vehicle is literally perfect for role playing we actually just need a matching outfit and we're good this one's not a bad outfit we got the fib badge we got a beautiful looking police cruiser i love how there's the red and blue and then you got some yellow in the middle that actually looks super super sick i could have done a better job with the wheels they don't look the greatest but it's all right drop a like if you enjoyed this video subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any more awesome gta online videos look out for some more chop shop dlc videos coming soon now click the video on screen now for the latest upload of mine i hope you all enjoy that video and peace